how to get started. So hi guys, today I'm going to be filming a beauty and a little bit of home decor haul. Um, these are things that I've gotten in the past two weeks. Um, so I've just been waiting for the chance to have a free day so I can film for you guys. The first face product that I got was from the Wet n Wild um, Center Stage Collection. And it's from the Fergie line and it is a shimmer palette. Um, I, I've been wanting to get this, but it's so hard to find the Fergie line in uh, Wet n Wild anywhere. So the only place that I found it was at Walgreens. And it's this pretty, um, high. I'm going to use this as a highlight. Um, highlight and mix with blush because it's, uh, it's a perfect shimmer. And it has pink tones, so it does give off the blush look. But yeah, so this was, I think, $6.99 or $7.99 but yes and so the next thing that I picked up at the drugstore was the CoverGirl Clean Whipped Cream Foundation. Um, I've been really really wanting to try this foundation out and I am in the tone 350 uh, Creamy Beige. Really I used it like um twice and I'm already in love uh, it's I want to say it's medium coverage but for me I really don't care about well I don't want sheer or little coverage but I, a medium to full coverage is fine with me um, it's just the way it feels it feels extremely light on your face but it is super creamy so I love that and um, I think this was around $10 I want to say 10 to 12. Um, if anything, I'll just put a link down below and you can see reviews on it. But yes, um, definitely try this product out because I did and I am I am in love with it. And another thing it, that I've been wanting to get is a regular loose face powder. And it's uh, obviously, this is the most basic um, loose face powder is the Airspun. Um, you can get this at any drugstore. And it's uh, translucent, but it's the extra coverage one. So, yep. And I don't go crazy with this all over my face. I do sometimes use this because it does feel pretty light on my skin. But I don't go crazy. So, yes. So, I actually got this really cool package from NYX. Um, and it was, it brought five lip products for the price of like 50 $13, $15, really good deal. So the first one I got was the Extreme Shine Lip Cream. Comes in a tube like this, and let's just swatch this out. I wouldn't want to say it's Extreme Shine, but it's like matte shiny, if that makes sense. It's super pigmented, and I really, really, really like this product. Um, I don't even need to put this on top of a regular li uh, lipstick or I don't need a lip gloss to cover it. It's just this, my lip liner, and I'm good to go. Um, the next product that I got was this. Um, it's in the color beige. I don't know why, but it's the Mega Shine Lip Gloss. It says beige on it. Um, so let me swatch this right next. It's like a bubble gum. It reminds me of bubble gum color. So, so it is this one right here. Um, yeah, and it's just a soft pink. This one's a little bit brighter and this one's a softer. So they're not all the same colors. If you were wondering if they were, they're not. Um, okay, so the next thing I got was the Pump It Up Limp Lip Plumper. I had once and couldn't really tell the difference. I mean, my, my lips are pretty... I don't know, good in size, I guess. But, um, yeah, so I can't really swatch this. It's pretty much clear with a little pink tone in it, but it comes in a container like this. And, yeah. You so my next product is one of my favorites and is one that I've been trying to get my hands on for a while, but this is the color that I've been wanting and I couldn't find it. Um, so it's the Soft Matte Lip Cream in the shade MLC06. So it comes in a tube like this. I'm going to swatch it. It is really matte, but it's so creamy. I don't even want to use all of the product to swatch it because I love it so much. But it's this one right here. 
You see how the other one like shines? This one's matte. I love this. So I got a butter gloss in the shade uh, BLG02 Eclair. So it comes like this, Eclair, Eclair, something like that. And then let's see how it looks. This is the brightest, I'm oh, not brightest, um, softest pink, lighter soft pink. I can barely even swatch it because it can't, I don't think it's going to come up. But this is definitely a lip gloss to put on top of um, any lip gloss to make it a little softer because as you can see it is extremely, and you see how shiny it is, it is extremely um, light. So that is it with the little package that I got. Um, but then I got two more lip products from NYX. And um, I wanted to put these two together. So I did. <laughs> so I've been wanting to try out uh, NYX's lipsticks because I got one a really long time ago and I hated it. But I'm like, you know what? I know they're revamping everything. So I want to give them a try. So I got it in 520. That's the shade number. And it is called Pandora. And it's like this. It's a nice purple, but it is sheer. It isn't like super... Let me show it to you. And that is the purple. I really, 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 really like it. Because it's super creamy. I That's what I like about these NYX products. So they're super creamy. I am... I hate when my lips feel like they're cracking or dry so I definitely recommend this in this color Ugh, purple is it MAC I picked up a, um, a lipstick from MAC because I've been craving one for a really long time so but I got it in the shade Cosmo A43 oh I love 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 this color it is oh, I mean MAC lip, uh, lipsticks are amazing, but uh, this color, I just, I thought, I love it so much. I have nothing like it. Um, I got something from the drugstore, specifically Walgreens, from the Wet n Wild. I wanted to try out their um, Mega Slicks. Um, okay, so I, it's the Moisturizing Lip Color Balm Stain, and I got it in a really... Uh, I got it in a stiff pink. I really wanted a bright pink color because I don't have anything that color and I really want to expand even though all of these are almost the same. I really wanted to get something, you know, that pops. I did try it on when I got home and I got it. Wasn't really impressed. Okay, so it's going to be this one right here. So it does feel really creamy and nice on your lips, but the color that I have it here is this, you know, nice pink. It's not like that on your, on your, it's super sheer on your lips. So I am going to be probably, I need to like oomph it up with um, a lip liner and maybe a lip gloss or probably just use this as a lip liner for a lipstick. I'll find a way to use this sucker, but yeah, not impressed. Okay, so the ne next Wet n Wild um, pro lip product is, I don't know why I got this color. You see, I, I always stay the same color scheme, but it's a Wet n Wild lipstick, and it is in the shade Mauve Out of Here, <laughs> Rose Flamboyant. Really, really like this. It is super creamy, and it does have a good pigmentation. Um... It's almost as if it's matte, but not really. I really like it this, so check it out. So probably it's I think it was only $1.99. Really good deal. Okay, my last lipstick or lip gloss. You guys. Okay, so this has got to be one of my favorite lip products because I did get this. I think this was I got this before all of these other products. So I have been wearing it every day literally on top of any lip color i've been wearing this this is by far one of my favorite lip um products that i've ever purchased and it's the l'oreal color rich lip gloss it's in the shade rich pink 120 oh my gosh i i can't i have it on right now but i do have a, a really light nude color underneath so it gives a little it's my first time trying those two combinations so it's a little bit different 
Yes, I actually picked this up randomly at Ulta and um, I got this on clearance for like three something. It was randomly on clearance. It was like the only one on clearance. I'm like, why is this on clearance? And by far one of my favorite, I mean favorite, favorite. And look at how cute the packaging is. I just really, really love this. Three lip liners. Three lip liners, all different brands. Uh, one is from MAC. And this one is just a normal um, nude color that I needed. And it is in the shade, let's see if I can pronounce this, Exterra. Exterra? Exterra, I think. Um, so yeah, so I got this. I really needed just a basic, uh, basic dark nude. And I got that with this. And yep, so just basic nude liner. Next is um, from NYX, surprisingly, N and it's in the shade, let's see what color this is. It's um, 843 Citrine, Citrine, I guess so, but it is a softer pink, but it does have like a little shine to it, and let me swatch it, so, yep. Yeah. Really, really like um, this liner. And then I got um, the Jordana lip liner. It is in the shade Cabernet. And the reason why I got this was like, you know what, let me just try this out. It was super inexpensive. But let me just try this um, lip liner out because one of my friends who also has a YouTube channel, I'll link her channel down below. But um, she wears this and swears by this liner and it looks amazing on her and it's just this and it, I think it's like 99 cents or $1.99 at the drugstore. I got this at Walgreens and it has amazing color payoff as you can tell. I mean, I love it. I really, really enjoy this um, lip liner. So go check out Jordana's um, makeup. Okay. So, I believe this is going to be my last beauty um, product, and it's the L'Oreal um, eyeshadow, and it is the 24-hour infallible, and it comes in a little tube like this. I hope I'm pronouncing it right. The pigmentation is amazing. Let me just do a little, and open it up, and it comes like in a little thing like this, and this is the color. What color did I get? I got... Uh, liquid diamond 996 so it's called liquid diamond and that is the color I look how pretty it is it is so pretty and it is a metallic silver but it does give off like purple blue undertones so yeah really really love this pick this one up at Target um, and they have really cool shades so definitely check this out Alrighty, so that is it for my beauty products. Now um, I'm going to move on to home decor. I picked up a cute little, um, cute little things at uh, Target and one one thing from Marshalls. So let's start with Marshalls, I guess. Um, so with Marshalls, I got. I wanted to. I'm reorganizing and decorating my desk area, so I wanted to get cute little stuff so I got this little container for my pencils and pens and this was only $4.99 and um, I have a mix of silvers and gold in my room so I just thought this was the perfect blend to put it together so yeah really nice so another container that I got was um, from Target it was $4.99 or no I think it was, no yeah it was on clearance I just got it today it was on clearance for two something two fifty, I think and it's just like this crystal little silver um, I don't know what I'm gonna use it for but I had to pick it up because it's on clearance so of course and then another little case um, I I got a bunch of all the rest of my stuff is from the dollar section at Target I really really love their, their dollar section they come up with the cutest little things out of nowhere so what I got was a little um container like this for a dollar and I probably am going to be putting a flower you know basic but I don't know what kind of flower yet I'm still putting my room together so this is my room back here but I'm still working on it I don't know what I'm doing with my room yet I'm still working on it but yeah so I got this container and then 
Um, I got some push pens um, for a dollar. They come in this cute little container like this. I haven't opened it yet. But um, yeah, they're just little pink pens. And then I really wanted these. And th these were the last ones. They're little clips. And I think they all like, they're so cute, the little stuff that they had. These were for a dollar. They come with five clips. So I printed out a bunch of Polaroids. I'm probably going to have to buy more. But I printed out a bunch of Polaroids. So I kind of want to do this whole Polaroid thing with clips. So that is my uh, plan that I'm doing with this. Next thing um, was from their same little cute little collection from this. Um, I got four different ribbons. They come in a little cute package like this. Another thing I got was a handmade card for a dollar. It's just they have a bunch of stuff on Valentine's and I just wanted to pick up a card because uh, I'm going to need that for Valentine's coming up. Another thing I got was from this, this is a cute little notepad for a dollar. I thought this was super adorable. Um, it's just to write down things I'm going to be needing or missing or yeah. And then my last thing is a little, it's kind of boring, but it is in a cute little chevron print. And it is just to, it's just an expanding file just to put in important stuff because I have a problem where I don't file my important stuff properly. So yeah, so I got this and this was a dollar also. So all of that for a dollar, which was pretty good. So yeah, that is it from my beauty and home decor haul. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Comment and um, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Alrighty, have a great day guys. Bye.